Hello guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to create a door with a, with a handle or a door knob. So open up your hammer and create your door archway which I've done here which basically I've used the cutting tool and just cut out a square. So now that we've done that just click your block tool and draw in your door or just replace the wall which you've cut out. So if I just quickly move it and click enter. Now I've chosen the wood the 014A texture which is right in here but you can use anything you want. So now it's in place I'm going to just change the width because it's a bit thick for a door and that is pretty much the door in place. So now what I'm going to do I'm going to make it a door so it moves. So click Control T Funk underscore door underscore rotating click apply and name it so I'm going to call it door underscore main I click apply right so now that we've got the door in place we need to make the handles oh no first things first though guys don't forget this that this circle here is what it literally is the hinge so what are your hinge off so I want it to be this side because the handles are going to be on the other so it has to be in line with the line to be honest with the end of the door if it doesn't let you for example if it's doing something like that and it's not letting you put it in the door that's because you haven't got enough lines so click this smaller grid left bracket for shortcut and just add some more and this should allow you to put it in place so quite basically now the door is done but now we want to attach some handles to it. So if I click the entity tool and write in problems called dynamic, as I've done already, and you click where you want the handle. Double click on the prop, go to world model, and write in door knob, door handle, handle, whatever you really want. I want door knob because it's got the handle I want. Um, my MDL files are updating. Now the door may look stupid but it's only for tutorial sake, I don't want to take my time with this. Right, so it's the wrong way around so I'm just going to change the angle and rotate it. Now never click alt guys, so just add some more lines to keep it in. Yeah, alright now do the same on the other side. I need to use door knob MDL not door knob B this is quite basically just a different handle um, just in case you didn't understand that go to world mode browse write in door knob again it will go for your MDL files and there's two type of handles one for the one side one for the other side and I'll just show you now quickly another thing guys the audio should be better on this video sorry if it's been quiet in all my others Right, so here we have we have one door knob and one door knob with double B, and as you can see, it's just basically the other way round. Yeah. So now that that's in place, that's the door sorted. But if you were to open this door now, it would open and the handles would stay still. So what you need to do now is double click on the handle, go to the parent, and write in whatever you named your door, which I named mine door and score main and do for the same for the other side. Double click it, parent, and write in why you need the door. Or you can click this little thing and click on the door. So that is pretty much it. It should work 100%. So I'm just going to quickly compile map and show you guys. Open up my Counter Strike. map door underscore tutorial which is what my map name has and basically this is my room very bad texture choice I can see but if I make it random right the handles there a uh, right bit low but you can adjust that my little archway and my door so if I open it it's open quite nicely and the door handles have gone with it so hope you enjoy guys hope this has helped you a lot this is mainly used in Counter Strike Left 4 Dead don't use it that much because you use problems go door and it's 
already there. But if you want to use this in Left 4 Dead, you can because it's just fun can go door, not problems go door. So yeah, basically, good luck and have fun.